by the grace of Almighty Allah, history was made in Kano, North Central Nigeria, when an additional medical facility built by the Ahmadiyya Muslim Jamaat of Nigeria was inaugurated by the Emir of Kano, His Royal Highness Alhaji Aminu Adubayero, on the 28th of January 2024. He was assisted by the Amir Ahmadiyya Muslim Jamaat of Nigeria, Alhaji Abdulaziz Alatoye Faransho Sahib, and members of the New Strand Jam Board, as well as top government officials in Kano. Located on Zaria Road, the hospital's foundation lane was done in July 2021 by the same Emir of Kano and flanked by the Amir Sahib and the then Kano State Commissioner for Health at an impressive ceremony. The Emir appreciated the tremendous efforts of the Ahmadiyya Muslim community to health and education development in Nigeria and globally, calling on the people of Kano and its environ to use medical facilities at all times. Alhamdulillah. Kamariya wale mukazuru wana wuri dansak har sajun wana gini awata yuli na dubu biu da ashirunda daya. Muna kara godia ka ubangiji ade enuna mana wana rana nambuti sabang asbitan ahmadiya awana gaime albarka. Wana zai kara tema kawa gomnati da jama'ar jihar Kano wajen kyautata lafiyar al'ummar In his welcome address the Amir Sahib appreciated the Kano Emirates under the leadership of the Emir of Kano for supporting the Jamaat's humanitarian projects and conducive environment for Ahmadiyya Muslim activities in his domain since 1922 he said Ahmadiyya Muslim Jamaat uh, Nigeria and uh, worldwide. We have the honest belief, Your Royal Highness, that Islam is a religion of peace. And Islam has absolutely nothing to do with violence. Almighty Allah told the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam that we have not sent you except as a mercy unto mankind. So Ahmadiyya focus on these teachings of the Holy Quran and of the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Speaking to journalists at the medical facility site, the Commissioner for Police, Kano Husseini Muhammad Gumel said, I'm aware that Ahmadiyya has built so many boreholes in the town schools and other facilities that are directly uh, uh, giving, putting impact to the lives of the, especially the vulnerable people. Kazim Akiniti reporting for MTA Nigeria Studios.